because when you damage one transformer, it costs over two hundred thousand dollars. Let's say one hundred kVA transformer, mm -hmm. it costs over two hundred thousand dollars. So that's a huge money. Usa etsa they pull that money. Usa government they pull the money. At the end of the day, we all we are consumers. We want electricity. So when you cause that damage, when you go cut the cable or vehicle hits any of the assets, it damages. Then at the end of the day, a target for replacing. Not so for free, but it go with the cost. And at the end of the day, we all, we all as consumers, we they pay for electricity. Also, the, that money they come up, and they come up from the tariff. Sometimes we can say light don't dare, mm. or electricity B don't go up. Sometimes there are some of the issues in this. So we really need to understand how the sector, they, how the electricity sector they work and the responsibility we'll get. So we are citizens who are responsible for law also protect the infrastructure of ETA or any other electricity infrastructure within our community. We need to make ownership of them so that we don't go allow any invaders, whether not take man there or not intruders there or not somebody who damage we follow or not we follow. But let will be accountable, hold them to tax. Let them not say when you boil them, they for pay. Let them not say not to me business, not enter the business. But at the end of the day, we all suffer. We not get light. And also, when the cost ETA do the operations for let them restore the power, the cost all they go into tariff. Yeah, I'm...